Here's a quick tutorial on how to make a star in InDesign. So there is no star tool. You'll notice if you click and hold on your rectangle tool, you'll see rectangle, ellipse, and polygon tool. Already highlighted here, we're gonna use the polygon tool. So make sure you have that opened up. Now when you use the polygon tool and you click and drag, it just makes a little polygon out here, just like that. So that's not a star, is it? Well, we're gonna make a star. We can actually turn this polygon tool into a star tool. Double click on it. It's gonna pull open the polygon settings. So these are like the default settings when you use the polygon tool. Right now we had five sides. That's fine, we'll make a five pointed star. The star inset, we want to be 50% or whatever you want, but you'll see what 50% does. Hit okay. Okay, now let's use this polygon tool again. Click and drag and look at that. I'm gonna hold shift so it doesn't squish and it makes a star. So we've officially made, I think, a very basic five point star here in Adobe InDesign. Now the star inset will adjust how sharp or how deep these, uh, I guess these armpits of the star are, but you can decide how, how deep you want that to be. Now, if you want that polygon tool to change back, just double click on it again. You can adjust this. You could make it zero, so it's always a polygon. And with the shape selected, it actually changes, which I didn't know, but it actually changes that shape. So you can see it live right there. So if you just select your polygon, and then, or your star, and then make some adjustments here, you can kind of see the difference between the different settings of this tool. So I'm gonna delete that real quick. I'm gonna take this back to zero and show you one more thing. If you just click on your document with the polygon tool, it's gonna to allow you to decide what type of shape to create just based on this. You don't even have to click and drag. So we could just tell it, hey, I wanna, you know, 50% star inset, five sides at this size, hit okay and it creates that star out there. Your polygon tool will then change to create that star every time, but that's just another way to create stars with the polygon tool here in Adobe InDesign.